Ever pondered about the real brains behind the first animatronics or robots? Let's travel back in time to a compelling tale unfolding in the year of 1924. In the heart of New Jersey, the acclaimed inventor Thomas Edison found himself in the eye of a storm. He voiced out, This is my animatronic or robot. But all my fellow inventor Mr. Benton did was pilfer my idea. Meanwhile, in the dynamic streets of New York City, inside the Robinson factory, a confrontation was in the making. The factory owner, Gary Roth, a covert agent working undercover, approached an inventor named Edwin Benton. Mr. Benton, Roth started. Yes, sir, Benton responded, a trace of doubt in his voice. Roth added, Mr. Edison asserts you copied his idea. A gasp escaped from Benton. Hold on, it's my idea. I crafted the Robin suit two weeks ago. Roth arched an eyebrow. You're the first one I've encountered with an animatronic, Mr. Benton. Benton rebutted. Well, I was collaborating with Thomas Roth, smirked. My name is Gary Roth, you jerk. Benton, taken aback, stuttered. Okay, Gary, this is my robot. Roth scrutinized the robot. Ah, your robot that only pivots its neck and churns out awful music. Benton defended. No, it's perfect, Mr. Roth. Unimpressed, handed Benton a paper. Oops, sorry, Mr. Benton. Can you sign here, please? Benton, feeling trapped, retorted, No, step off. After the door locked behind Benton, Roth turned to Edison. Mr. Edison, your plan has failed. Now what? Edison, frustrated, responded, Crap! Now we have to go to plan B. Break the robot. It's the same plan we had for Nikola Tesla. Roth nodded. Yes, Mr. Edison. And thus, the saga of the first animatronics and robots began. A tale of theft, deceit, and innovation, where the lines between the true inventors and the impostors blurred. Even today, the question remains, who truly invented the first animatronics or robots? Was it Thomas Edison, the acclaimed inventor, or was it Edwin Benton, the underdog in this high-stakes game of innovation?